it was definitely uh, something I've been wanting to do for a long, long time. And um, having, after seeing how the team's been performing the last uh, four or five games and seeing all the great wins we've had and how the team's really gelled together, I think it's, it was a bit of a no-brainer. So I'm, I'm really delighted to finally get pen to paper. I love that I've been able to grow as a player and a person and show what I can do on the, in the Premiership, which is probably the highest level you can play at, apart from international. So it's something that I've been working towards since I've been a young kid and just been really great to see the progress I've made and that I'm, I can play at the Premiership and I can play, I score tries and hopefully it continues. I played my academy rugby with some of my best mates from school um, and then being able to go through the ranks and then making my Premiership debut last year against Leicester, it's kind of a yeah, like the typical dream come true sort of thing, but it's just, it's just amazing to think and look back on how 10 years ago I was watching games here or across the road and now I'm playing with people who I was watching. So it's, um, it's pretty special and it's definitely, Harlequins have definitely not only made me a better player, but a better person throughout with being around the, peop the players and the staff. And yeah, it's just, and I'm really happy to continue this. Definitely Mike, Mike Brown. Um, uh, as my mentor, so from the moment I came in as an academy player, um, as a first year, he took me under my wing. We went through all my loan games together. Um, he's always helped me on the field. A bit tough love, but you know that's the way he does it. Um, he never, it's never personal. He he knows he he expects more from me when I make a mistake, and he makes it lets me know about. It. And that's definitely something on and off the field has made me such a better person and a player.